Assalamu alaikum everyone, yes I'm back with a new video. In today's video, I'm going to be trying a new Samyang ramen flavor. Today's Samyang ramen flavor is seafood party, seafood flavor from Samyang. As you can see, it is halal certified, made in Korea. At the back you have the cooking instructions. I'm going to follow exactly these cooking instructions. So let's open this and see what kind of treasures await us. Here is the soup base, so pretty, seafood party soup base, always matches the color outside the packaging. Then we have the seafood party flakes. Here is the noodle block. Now the noodles are made from wheat flour, refined palm oil, modified tapioca starch, modified potato starch, refined salt, glycerin, soybean oil, thickener is wargum, acidity regulator, potassium carbonate, sodium carbonate, sodium phosphate dibasic, citric acid purified water emulsifier is soy lecithin. The flakes are dehydrated pollock, which is fish, dried cabbage, dried carrot, dehydrated chives, dried seaweed. The soup base is a powder, not in liquid form. Mmm, it smells so fishy. The soup base powder consists of Salt, bling of fish powder, flavor enhancer, monosodium glutamate, disodium ribonucleotide, white sugar, cuttlefish powder, yeast powder, shrimp powder, soy sauce powder, anchovy extract powder, clam extract powder, palm oil, garlic powder, paprika extract, black pepper powder, chili extract. Smells like the seaside. So let's get to the kitchen and cook this up. Follow me. Okay, so I have everything ready here. We have some sweet corn, some chili flakes in sesame oil, a teaspoon of butter, spring onion chopped, but it's without the green. 550 ml of bottled water. I don't use the tap water. Here are the flakes, the soup base, the noodles. That's the plating station. And here are some extra seafood guests. If you have more vegetables that you like, you can add them. I think corn really goes well with seafood as well as butter. So let's get that ready first and then we're gonna cook the noodles. Teaspoon of butter, spring onions, chili flakes, and corn. Let that just cook. And now we focus on the noodles. Adding 550 ml of bottled water. Let this come to a boil. Then we will add flakes, soup base and ramen. I turned off the stove. So here is the corn and spring onions all caramelized. Mm. Come to a boil, add our noodle block. Add the stragglers, flakes, soup base powder. Cooking this for four minutes, separate the noodles with a fork, chopstick, tongs, whatever you have. Just to make sure the noodles don't stick together and they cook evenly. Okay, four minutes are done. Now you can add the noodles to that, but that will make all of this soggy. So you can add it on top. Mm. Time to eat. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim mm -mm. That is delicious Now noodles have a bite to them They are really springy, chewy and slurpable The noodles are firm and in this case It is a good thing because it's swimming in soup and would have gone mushy and soggy. You will see later on how the noodles held their shape. The noodle block is tightly packed in such a way as to not overcook them. 
Now the broth itself is very flavorful and spicy, but the spiciness has been toned down because of the butter. I did add a little bit of salt and I'm glad I did. The broth is not oily and it is soaking in the noodles so well. The dehydrated pollock, dried cabbage, carrot, chives, and seaweed all hydrated very well and were in good amount to provide a texture break that livened up the chewy noodles and the hot broth. All of these elements together bring a harmony of a seafood party. I am so rude. Say Bismillah ar-Rahim. Mmm, how is it? Good, right? Especially for monsoon season. Uh, this is a great pick-me-up. Mm -mm. So everyone, if you really enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, press the bell icon so you're notified of any future videos that I might post, leave a constructive comment, and share this video. I really appreciate it. As always, thank you so much for your support and encouragement. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Allah is Bye. Jazakallah khair, thank you so much for watching till the end of this video. If you want to watch similar videos, please check out the playlist right here. Check it out.